the matrix matrix product has some nice properties that are comparable with just working with reals just numbers for instance the first property that we will call associativity so if you have three matrices with the right dimensions so that B and C is defined and AB is defined and uh, then the order in which we multiply the matrices is not important so A times BC grouped equals uh, the grouping of A, B and C also a property that is similar to what we have in working with reals is something that we will call distributivity so A times the sum of two matrices is just A times B plus A times C and also A plus B so if we multiply C from the right hand side then we get A times C plus B times C also multiplication by some constant K the scalar is can be done by multiplying the product but there are differences an important difference is that we do not have commutativity so where we had for real numbers for instance a property like 2 times 3 equals 3 times 2 we cannot do the same thing here anymore so it, something that is very important um, which should be noted carefully is that in general we do not have a times b equals b times a not even if both products are well defined so finally the final property if we take a product and, tr and transpose the product of two matrices then we may calculate it as the matrix B the latter matrix transposed by A transpose so here the order truly matters which should be clear by following the red 4 so that we do not have commutativity so you cannot interchange A and B in a product automatically.